Hello you, welcome to Geekism and welcome back to the movies. We're cracking on here and uh, I'm actually going to build another one of these. This is a great idea. Uh, somebody said I want to build more than one PR office because PR takes so long and I didn't even think that would be a thing, but it is a thing. So let's do the thing. We're going to make a thing. Uh, we're going to make a thing and also I've cleared out this whole Bomb Street uh, set that we just frank quite frankly don't use. Um, so instead, we're going to put some new sets down that we just unlocked. Um, to, they're a bit more sort of modern. We've got a rural field, great place to plant the movies. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, let's have a look. Here's the Starship Bridge now. Living Room 2. Yeah, that's kind of thing we're thinking of. Suburban Modern Jail, Suburban School Corridor, Suburban Street, Tropical Beach. Ooh. Urban Alleyway, Urban Bar. Oh my god, there's basically loads of urban hotel rooms. We're not making that sort of movie. Rooftop, subway station. Wow, there's loads. Okay, let's let's pick a few. I, I really like the idea of this beach, but I reckon it's going to be massive. Yeah, it is. Oh, look, it looks good though, doesn't it? Um, The bar, I think, will be pretty good. Good addition. Let's turn it around there. So we'll have the bar, that's a good one. And we're going to spend a few quid here, so we're hopefully going to make this back. Uh, City Street, I reckon that's going to be a big one as well. Yeah, okay, we'll look at maybe putting a few of them at the top. City Block Corridor. Ah, oh, that's cool. Um, stick you there. Let's see if there must be a little tiny, tiny, tiny one we can squeeze into there. So look. What about that um, living room? Oh, no, never mind. Uh, no, they're going to be huge. Street. Oh, that's like a suburban street. That's a cool one as well. Oh, we're really getting some nice uh, choices here, aren't we? Um, we need that city street, though, don't we? We just need it. Um, let's put it up here. Okay. There we go. They're the ones we want. What's up with you? Oh, he's retiring. Yeah, I know you're retiring. That's okay, buddy. You finish up this film and you can be on your way. Um, there we go. Join you up. I assume Kieran needs having a drink. Well, you kind of let him, don't you? Really? There we go. This is all dirty, by the way, because that set went down, so... Hopefully that'll uh, sort that out. Okay, so now we've got those sets. Let's start working. What I want to do on this episode, I should have said, shouldn't I? Uh, I want to make a romance movie. Seeing as the last one went down so well, I want to make our own uh, romance movie. So our, our genre is going to be romance. I'm going to turn all these off and then turn them back on again so that they're all empty. Uh, we're going to call it... Um, we're gonna call it. We, we've just oh, we've just got that bar. So let's call it um, raising raising the bar. Okay, and we're, it's gonna set in the bar. It's gonna be incredibly intelligent. Uh, so the lead is gonna be Jenny Armstrong. Who's gonna play Emma Jack? Yeah. Okay. Um, and uh, support is gonna be uh, Brian Smith. And our second support is going to be Anna Black. So I can't have Emma Jack and Emma Black. So let's have Emma Dilemma. Because she's going to have a dilemma in this movie. Brian Smith is the most boring name ever. Anna Black, that's fine. Uh, let's decide what you're all going to look like. In fact, you're probably going to look fine as is, to be honest with you. AC suit. I mean, you could wear a ridiculous dress. But to be honest with you... Uh, now, this is going to be like a... When Harry met Sally, kind of thing. So clothes wise, they're all pretty good. Okay, so intro uh, is going to be. It's only showing us the ones we've got, isn't it? Yeah, and there's the ones we haven't got. Okay, so urban. Let's start on the a winding corridor. A helpful new movies with twists and turns. Sex lighted, progressive comedy role. Okay, let's go for the city block corridor. Um, yeah, two walking and talking. Where are you? But, no, see, 
See now you guys have, have changed your outfits now. So what why is that happening? Does it do we have to sit there and actually select this? You are going to wear this. Because I want you businessy. You're gonna you're business people. We did it with you already, didn't we? Okay, good. Yeah, okay, there you go. They're wearing the right clothes now. But it's not gonna be these two, it's gonna be you and you. Okay, what's the uh, the camera like here? That's pretty good actually. Um I think I think it's probably quite Okay, so there they go, they're walking talking. So what they're chatting about, hey girl, bad time you met a new man. That's the kind of thing. I'm gonna be this is please don't let me be too sexist, but I I might be a little sexy. I'm not really a fan of this kind of movie, you know. Um so We'll 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 see. Uh, arrested? No. So they're all they're all very like intense, you know. Um. Read a book. Read a funny book. Lots of book readings here. Busy corridor. with guns and everything out of it what are the options here mood okay happy mood oh here's your mace okay okay so you're now her uh, okay, so this is the first scene. We'll move the, we'll sort these around, but then they chat, ha 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 ha, and then oh, it shows them walking off separate. That's a bit annoying. Um, I suppose we could put it in post and try and trim it. Can we do this? Can we go boop? Nope. Uh, and delete that one. Whoops. So, okay, so here we go. Leading lady comes in. Leading lady comes in, chats to her mate, and then we, ha 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 ha, we'll cut it there in post, okay? And then, and the next scene, they don't, they don't walk away separately, they walk away together, but we, we do it forward like that because, actually, no, no, let's do it backwards. Okay, good. That's the first two scenes. There we go. So now, you're gonna, um, Okay, let's do one more. Uh, oh, I like the idea of a static establishing, sh establishing shot. Oh, yeah, that's good, isn't it? I want to move you, though. How do we move scenes? I don't actually know we can do it. Yes, we can do it. We drag that thing first. Okay. Toggle you off. Oh, right, yeah, I'm all about that. Um, now, lady, you gotta leave. Uh, your mate's gotta leave for now. Um, let's search for leave. Or is it exit? I can't remember what they call stuff in this. I think it's exit. Yeah, we go. Um, monsters exit, group exit. Or does the group go in the lift? I quite like the idea of a group going in the lift. Yeah, but not you. Get out of this scene. Oh no, they're just going to a room. That's no good. No, don't like that. I thought you were getting in the lift. Unless maybe they were and we just picked the wrong spot. Um, Sorry, let's try that again. City block corridor. But exit. Uh, exit door. Let's see if we can... Sometimes with this you can... No, you can't. Okay. What? That is, that's a completely different shot to the one we Oh no, group exit we did, didn't we? Um, well, 
Right, let's try once more. <laughs> exit. Exit door, group exit. I don't really want any of them. I just want, like, one person to clear off. Oh, let's turn suggested off. There we go. Exit briefcase. Someone carrying a briefcase wants to have you. Exit. Group exit. Scared exit. Is there not just an exit? I suppose we could do it that way, couldn't we? And we'll have you. No, hold on. Yeah, so you're the one who's leaving now. So you leave. Oh, no, 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 sorry. You leave. There we go. You're not in this scene. And then we have to turn these into wooden mannequins. So, no, play the scene. There we go. So these ones become you and you. There we go. And then they're not in the scene anymore. Okay. Okay, so she's left. Okay, so now here comes the meeting. Um, yeah, so it's on the streets. Actually, no, that's ridiculous that we just got a scene of her leaving. Let's just cut to the... Let's just cut. They've chatted. Ha ha, see you later. Okay. So, city streets. Um, like, like... Is there like a bump into each other or something? That'd be really good. Like, trip? No, it's not suggested a sec. Fall? <laughs> it says like I'm doing a PPI advert. Have you been in a trip or fall? Um, let's have a look then. Uh, intro. No, not intro. We want to do like a meeting. Shut up. Uh, oh, what's that? Car eye contact. No, oh, I like that. Yep, yeah, that's good. Although it's the wrong actress. We could, I suppose we could call it Taxi Driver, he's in a taxi, or we could just change the prop. Let's put him in a nice car. Let's put him in a real nice car. What's the, like, the nicest car we've got? No, it's, it's not that. Uh, I like how it's all the cars that we can actually have on the set. What are you? No, standard 80s car. 70s taxi, 70s car, so standard 80s car, there we go. Folded newspapers. Can't actually see where the newspapers are. So I'll let that go. Okay, but how do we get these to meet now? How do we actually get them to, to start chatting? Uh, let's have a look. Oh, romantic meet. Maybe that could do it for us. Right, ah, so she can't believe his look. No, no, this is this should be the other way around then. You should, you're in the car, my love. And you're having a little wonder. Yeah, she gets out. And he's like, whoa, whoa, whoa. What a woman. Okay, cool. Let's get rid of this car one then. Because that doesn't make any sense anymore. Okay. Okay, so now he's got to go and buy some flowers or something. I don't know if it, even like buying is a thing. 
Oh, I'll buy flowers, perfect. Okay. So he's not she's not he's not really buying them, he's just kind of grabbing them, but that'll do, mate. Um Okay. And then let's do another one. Let's just see what flowers options there are. I wonder if I like a give flowers. Walk with flowers, give flowers, yeah, there we go. Why does it always put her in it? Lady, you you're like a no one in this movie. <laughs> yep. There we go. It'd be nice if she wasn't so amazed, because she's never met the guy before. Hmm. There's no option to change that one. Uh, all right, we'll go with it. So time apart. We need a time apart. Let's go to um, later that day. Right, got it. Let's do it. See if there's like a chat, chat, bar chat up. Someone chats up someone else at a bar. Yeah, perfect. Yeah, perfect. But it needs to be the other way around. Okay, so he tries to chat her up. Um, and then um, argument, heated argument between the two women. Well, if that's a mood, angry, right, angry mood, sad. Yeah, not happy with you. Chatting up. Okay, and then she apologises. This is the most boring movie I've ever seen in my life, but then these kind of movies are, aren't they? Um, I'll be honest with you. No. Forgive? No. Uh, sorry? No. Resolution. Uh, we don't. We don't. We don't want like a fight or anything. Uh, what about? Uh, mon what about money but we can change the money prop no I'm trying to think of a way of like get her giving her flowers or something and it reminds her of the guy I don't know I don't know so they fight um uh hmm Really strong. Oh, what was that surprise one then? Two people sit and have a risque conversation. What about something like So yeah, I didn't know. I didn't mean it, baby. I don't know what I'm doing here. Uh, last one then. Let's go back to the bar and some sort of kiss. Couple kiss. Romance, passionate. Right, that's you, that's you. Yep, 
Looks good to me. And finally, let's just have them drive off. Uh, full stuff or into. I don't want ev ev just everything with a car in it. Uh, for for exit a car, does that mean you get out of the car or you exit with a car? Right, you, you get out of the car, that's no good. We want, a, uh, want something where you drive off into the sunset, you know? Because that kind of makes sense, I guess. Oops, spell leave right would help. Leave. Uh, oh, couple leave. What about couple leave? No car. Just couple leave. Yeah, but that's you. That's. Come on. Come on out so I can see you. Yeah, that's you. Oops. Mood. Happy. Okay. Oh, look at him. Chuffed to bits. The end. Is that three stars? It's three stars. Cool. It's done. Let's get it casting. So they should all pop into it. Yeah, and then our director is, I believe, Jasmine Carr. There we go. Awesome source. And then as soon as Detroit Crime City is ready to release, this guy will retire. She can take his trailer. Margaret Wells, you're going to be, oh, you're our new action lady, aren't you? That's right. So let's get you sorting out some action practice. There we go. And maybe you could do a bit with the... Uh, Oh, you're all on set, aren't you? Yeah, satirise, yeah, so far as the new guy. Okay, are you all, can you all just go and finish your movie, please? Thank you. There we go. It's like last scene, isn't it? Scene eight of nine, right, come on, let's just get it done, please. Um, okay, so we have now written... Oh, what was that then? I don't know, we've got a good thing with him. So we've now written uh, Raising the Bar. And it's currently... Where is it? Oh, it's here. It's rehearsing. It's ready to go. Go for it. Shoot it. No extras. Forget the extras. Could have, probably could have thrown a few extras in, to be fair. But never mind. Um, I'm hoping that this ends up being pretty good. Where's the last set? Urban Office. Right, so they're... Everyone's on set. What's up with you? Oh, you're retiring. That's fine. I know this. You retire when the film finishes, don't you? So, step off. You should all be able to go straight back on again, pretty much. Yeah. Stop getting drunk. Yep. Yeah. Star Mood's here. Star Mood. Daniel's here. Who else? Anyone? No, are you drunk as well? Everyone's everyone is hammered. Fantastic. Who are we waiting on? Oh no, who are we waiting on? Kieran Nee has finished shooting. So Kieran Nee, you are gonna whoops. You're gonna be Mr. PR. We're gonna PR the hell out of this. Alright. Are you saying it's a wrap? Oh, the other la the other film's a lady director, isn't it? Okay. Come on then, this nothing's happening. Ah, there we go, they're waiting for extras. Cool. Carry on then. Um maintenance level's low. Can we It looks like by the way that that mod that I said I installed didn't work. I think it has to be a new save file, unfortunately. It's a shame. But there's this crew wandering around, so I'm hoping they're doing what they're gonna do. Let's see if they do the do. That needs good maintenance. 
Are you heading that way yet? You can head over to here. I mean, these should all be really good maintenance because they're new, aren't they? Stress level's low. I don't care. Film's finished. As soon as it's done, you're going straight into PR, Simon Forrester. Are you ready for it, buddy? Here it comes. There we go. Say, so, say, so it's a wrap. Oh, I've missed a bit of path there, look. There it is. Ta -da! Um, let's just fix that before I forget about it. Oop, there we go. Right, so you get into PR as well. One of your stars is to juice retire. That's fine, you can clear off, buddy, whenever you're ready, mate. Thanks for your time. PR complete, good. So you can do the movie now. You, you uh, we're going to go real big on PR for this one. So you and, you, why are you wearing underwear? I'm not going to ask. You and your mate, Dan. Oh, you're only acquaintances now, so that's fine. You and you. And you, oops, excuse me, thank you. Can you just like talk for a minute? There we go. Um, one of your stars is retiring due to old age. Absolute pleasure working with you, Mace. Can I sell you? 39 quid. No. Well, my, well, do you know what? 39 quid, innit? Better than nothing. See you later. <laughs> um, so. Where is empty? Is it that one? There we go. That should make her a bit happier. This movie's still doing PR there. Good. We're slowly hemorrhaging cash. Uh, that's probably because Love the Sinner is no longer making money, but that's fine. We can archive it. You are doing PR. Your PR progress is pretty good. As soon as that's finished, I think we'll probably put the film in once more. Uh, before we get a release, or should we just go for it? Nah, do you know what? We'll go for it. That's we've had a two actors and the movie do PR. I say we put that at a middle as a middling budget. We're probably laughing. Okay, come on then, finish up, buddy, and then you can go and get drunk or whatever you want to do. There we go. Uh, the film itself needs to finish up. There we go. Awesome. So let's put you for a mm, let's do a slight living release than normal. See if that helps. This crit quality is full st three stars. Everything here should be pretty good. A pair of sets could be better. We could make that excellent, really. Um, novelty and tech is always pretty good. PR is superb. That should be a good four star movie. Ooh, this could be our best movie yet. Detroit Crime City. This isn't one we wrote ourselves. Oh. Do, do, do. It's a sexy dance party. It's a Bog Brush Productions. Detroit Crime City. Do, 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 do. Melvin Hackler. This is like uh, Robocop. God, he's an ugly so and so him on the right. I mean, they're not, neither of them are particular lookers. Oh, look at this. He's the maverick cop who don't play by the rules, but god damn it does he get results. Yeah, and that's his that's his boss. He says, give me a badge. There's an alien. <laughs> they always give him that haircut, look, bald hair. Oh, camera zooming in, it's serious. I'm not happily with your progress, swamp thing. We've had complaints. <laughs> oh man, this music's intense. This is the most boring scene with a swamp creature in it I've ever seen in my life. Okay. He's looking through. He's nothing he can do about it. He's been fired. He had to hand in his gun and his badge. But the swamp things come to get him. <laughs> Whoever it was who made these movies. Oh. Oh no, he's going to smack him around there with that. Was it enough? Nope. <laughs> That's what I'm thinking. Put him on his bum. Oh, look at that. Slow zoom. 
carry him out. Carry him into the... Oh, there you go, Swamp Thing. Job well done. What? What is this film? Like, to be honest with you, if if he wasn't dressed like that, this would have actually been a pretty good movie. <laughs> Why did they have to mess him like a Swamp Thing? Okay, good. I'm happy with that anyway. That was a pretty good movie. I enjoyed it. I'd be happy if I went to the cinema and saw that. Um, loads of star ratings. Kieran Knee's moving up the star ratings. Cost us half a mil, that one did. No negative. Oh, this is going to go straight into number one. Oh, number two. Not quite. I'll take it. Number two. I'll take a number two. He said. Up to number six now. Awesome. Stress. That's fine. Your entourage is pretty low. To be honest, pal, if somebody came in, you could have them, but you know what it's like. Movie crew. Never mind. Okay, cool. So, Detroit Crime City and Raising the Bar is now filming. Yeah, I'd say we've had a good episode. That's great. We'll have a look what um, Raising the Bar looks like in the next episode, and we'll we'll write our own action movie as well. We'll use some of these uh, new sets for action as well, I think. Oh, look at that one. That's a cool-looking one. Wicked. Right, thanks very much for watching. Hope you've enjoyed it. If you have, please give us a like. It really does help out the channel. And if you're not already, don't forget to subscribe. Any thoughts, queries, or suggestions, you can pop them down in the comments. And if you um, fancy chat, you can find me on Twitter. I'm at John T. Sparrow. If you'd like to join in with the Geekism community, you can do so on our Geekism Discord server. You'll find the link for that in the description. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you in the next one.